everyone. I'm Larry Ridley, and this is the NFL on EA Sports. Every wide receiver in the NFL wants to be a top target, and two players will be trying to be that today. It's Green's Bengals going up against Allen's Chargers. Now let's head down to Jim Nance and Phil Sim for this Week 2 matchup. Chargers, Bengals coming up here on EA Sports. Week 2, football on tap as we get set for today's game. Down on the sidelines, there's Marvin Lewis, longtime head coach of the Cincinnati Bengals. His team has played well. In fact, great just last week in a victory. And on the other side, it's Mike McCoy. His team is off to a great start, and it shows as they won just last week. Rivers will take the snap from the gun. Rivers finds Allen. That is how you draw it up, isn't it, Phil? Oh, man, a quarterback loves guys that can make catches like this, and they're just so strong. They know how to zero in. They never lose concentration, and you never see him drop a pass. quarterback and takes him down every defense is looking for somebody to hit the quarterback and the best person to do it is the defensive end the chargers line up in the pistol <laughs> philip rivers unloading the long pass Well, it's a big game by the offense, and that's what this league is about. We talk about so many things. Oh, play good defense, don't turn it over, but it's about big plays. you got to take chances down the field. The quarterback was willing to do it that time, and he made it happen. Great qualities for a linebacker. Phillip Rivers from the shotgun. Ball is out. This one's going back. We have a review coming from the booth. So they're looking to see if the ball came out before the knee was down. I think when you look at these plays, most of the time it's pretty easy to determine. Uh, Jim, you know, you can, it's just always a clear shot. When that knee hits the ground, you can freeze that shot and determine if it's a fumble or down by contact. After reviewing the play, the ruling on the field stands. Took a moment for them to validate it, but the word comes back from the replay booth. The play on the field will stand. Hills taking it on the screen. Has 12 on this play. From the gun, Phillip Rivers ready for the snap. Third and goal from the seventh. Touchdown, Chargers. He's now caught 100 touchdown passes in his career. Fewer than 10 players in NFL history can make that claim. Hard to cover these tight ends when they get into the end zone because they're fast, they're nimble, and they're big. So even if you cover them, they push off and get the touchdown. The second quarter is underway with this snap. The Bengals get a first down, and they advance the ball over the other side of the field. Nice job that time, but the tight end makes the catch, and you've got to look out for them now in the NFL. Remember, they're usually the closest receiver to the quarterback. Quarterback gets in trouble. He's going to look for the tight end. Taking the handoff. It's a gain of six. He's averaging five yards per carry on the day. Well, that last play almost got him in here. And when you look at this, what do they do? Well, you just want to punch it in. A... First down at the 28. Woodhead off the left side. <laughs> the 
the Bengals defense now is going to go nickel they'll hike it to him out of the shotgun Rivers finds Gates Chargers in the end zone and Gates his second touchdown of the game And as we near the half, the lead now is theirs thanks to that touchdown. Yeah, you know, how. look at that. Just think about how much that changes the mentality of both teams. One now all psyched up and emotionally feeling great. And the defensive side, oh, my gosh, they are down. Third and long. Looking long. Comes away with it. Receiver Phil is a quarterback's dream. Going high in the air on a high throw and getting the reception. Oh man, do quarterbacks love that? They throw it, think, oh my gosh, that's bad. They're they're ready to chase the defender down with an interception. But no, the wide receiver goes up and just makes an awesome catch. 380. He has the grab. And that's KO in on the stop. The defense is ready to plug up the middle here on the goal line. Hill's going to take the hit. Runs it across. Touchdown. Heading toward halftime. And the complexion of this game certainly has changed as they've now tied it up with the touchdown. Yeah, you, and when you're tied up at halftime, you don't know how to look at it sometimes. Are we doing great or are we not playing well enough to be winning? The offensive line is doing an awesome job. Receivers getting open, the running backs running hard. It is fun to watch. Gains 11. The Chargers call a timeout. They're first. First and 10. Surveys. Intercepted. Big lane. Tackles made. The first half is complete. Larry Ridley ready to take things over back in the studios. And you're watching the NFL on EA Sports. Thanks, Jim, and welcome to the EA Sports Halftime Report. Let's get to it. Right now, we've got a tie game, and that just means exciting football for us in the second half as we'll have two teams playing two quarters to decide a winner. All right, here we go. Let's take a look at some of the highlights from the first half. Chargers opening drive. Lloyd's got the catch, but fumbles here. Offense out now after the fumble. The pass ends up being picked off. Pollard's reading the play and comes away with it, ending the drive. Offense out now following the INT. Quick pass and completion to the former basketball player, Antonio Gates. And after the short pass, he'll score. Chargers with the early advantage. Chargers with the ball late in the half. Quick pass is complete, and he'd cap off the 10-play drive with a TD. The Chargers up by a touchdown. Still late in the first half, Dalton's throw goes to the sidelines. And he'll end up picking up 48 yards on the play. Still late stages of the second. Hill's going to look for a gap, and he'd cap off the 11-play drive with a TD. Bengals tied up at 14. Still a little time left on the clock. Here the defense will come up with the pick. Iloka is happy to come away with the pick and end the drive. So that's it for us at the EA Sports Studio. We'll go back out to Paul Brown Stadium for the start of the second half. Johnson's got it on a pass, had some heat on it. Rivers is going to take the snap from the shotgun. Jarring hit that time, knocks the ball free. Good timing by the defensive player that time. He gets to the receiver, 
just as the football is getting there. And Dropping back into the shotgun formation. Third and forever. Launching it deep. Brandon Flowers picks off that pass. The Chargers seemingly had everything going early with the passing game, but it's been a big change since. Tate's got a chance this time. Breaks free, has some spin on his way. The 10, nobody was going to catch him there. Touchdown. When you play special teams in the NFL, it's all about hustle. The punt team showed none of it. That's why they gave up that punt return for a touchdown. The Chargers still trail, but as we look at the passing numbers, it's hard to find much fault with them. Rivers has led his team on the field today and has posted some very impressive numbers. Yeah, the offense has been sharp, and I'll say this. To the ground. The Chargers turn the ball over on down. Well, what the coach is trying to do, he's trying to give his team a lift. They're down. It's fourth and short. They go for it, and there is no lift there. The offense doesn't come through. Takes it from the strong eye. And Bernard is brought down. That's going to be a pickup of 10. The Bengals, they never back off. That Dalton's alone in the backfield. Dalton's back in shotgun formation. Dalton over to Eifert. The Chargers will take the snap from the 40. Rivers connects with Antonio Gates. Today, if you do that, I think you'll catch it by surprise. Just a quick drop back. Intercepted. That brings the play to an end. Rivers is going to be kicking himself for a long time when he thinks back on that interception. A critical error at the worst possible time. Phil. Oh, I, hey, listen, it was the worst. It was a bad, it was bad timing. And I'll tell you, the coaches might be trying to kick him too because that took all the chances away they had for winning this game. It was a nail biter. It wasn't pretty, but it goes down as a victory. It's even sweeter when you win a close game in the league because you know how hard it is. And to make that one play, that was the difference. Whew, a lot of joy in the locker room. So for Phil Sims and all the crew at EA Sports, Jim Nance saying so long for now.